Hello everyone, this is Mark Crayon. This is my tic-tac-toe project for my PMP4 class. To make this project, I used a Unity tutorial interaction with the game board. It helped me out throughout the project. Let's go ahead and check out tic-tac-toe. So for tic-tac-toe, X, O, X, O, X. So X wins with three in a row. O wins, and the other possibility is a draw. Draw. So to build this game, I had to take a few steps. I started out by making the panels. I made a panel for the background. I made a panel for the board. I designed the grid space of the board. Then began with the UI buttons, which I called grid space. Right. The the buttons. What I did to make the buttons, I began. I started out by making a prefab. I added a script to the prefab, and then in the inspector, I would go. I added the on click. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. Actually, so here's here is the grid space for the button. I added the grid space button in here. The text in here. The grid space script went on the on click then I set the I set the function to grid space set space after the button I duplicated it eight times I set the integers to the buttons assigned all the buttons after that I put on a game controller script which is about 170 lines of code over here so in my script I added a few variables such as button text button list game object game over panel text game over text game object restart button I added a variable called it player X player color player color to active player color inactive player color I made a public string called it player side private integer called it move count in the avoid awake we set the game controller reference on buttons player side equals X the move count equals zero. Let's go down here to. In the public void, what I did was in the public void and turn is where we check for the winning conditions. So move plus plus if button list is zero dot text is equal to player side button is what this line of code right here is telling us is that that at zero one and two we're checking the boxes which is the top three rows in the tic-tac-toe board so over here three four and six would be the three middle boxes six seven and eight are the three bottom boxes so for example button zero would be the top left so as where three would be the left middle and as six would be the left bottom so as we go through, the, I duplicated the script eight times. So now we have nine. Well, yeah, we have nine condi We have nine winning conditions. One, two, three. Yeah, nine winning conditions. At the bottom of the, of the script, it says move count is greater or equal to nine. What this is doing is telling or set game over text to draw. What this script is telling us is once we have played nine times it goes to a draw if no one has won void set players player new player player old player this right here is the panel colors with player x yeah when player x is playing it'll highlight on player x when player o is playing it'll highlight player o let uh, wearing the player which the players whose turn it is um for so far it's tic-tac-toe i learned a lot from it learned about the approaches of programming tic-tac-toe organizing scripting I learned how to this was my first experience with the game of 170 lines of code I think I did pretty good but anyways this is my tic-tac-toe this was my project thank you for watching